Here are some of the popular actors who lost control and took things a little too far. Margot Robbie. Mommy is just so sick and tired of wearing panties. What most people don't know about the all-time favorite Wolf of Wall Street is that in the heated bedroom fight scene between the acting couple, Margot actually slapped Leonardo in the face. Not on purpose, though. You're not f***ing taking my children, you vicious f***ing f*** you, you f***ing f***ing not f***ing taking my Leonardo DiCaprio. Acting in the heat of the moment can sometimes get a little scary, like DiCaprio did in the movie Django Unchained. By accident, he hurt himself on a piece of broken glass, but continued with the performance. The director thought the blood to be a nice touch of realism so the scene wasn't cut. Hey! flat on that tabletop! If you lift those palms off that turtle shell tabletop, Mr. Pooch is gonna let loose with both barrels that sawed off! Isla Fisher. Everyone loves magic tricks, but I'm pretty sure Isla Fisher didn't particularly enjoy it in a scene of the movie, Now You See Me. Being chained in a tank of water seemed cool at first, until she actually got tangled up in her chains. George Clooney. Number three is called... Pulling nails from fingers. What do you think, Bob? Number three sound good to you? While filming a torture scene in Syriana, George flipped his chair a little too hard, causing him an injury which he described as so horrific he almost contemplated suicide. Yikes. It was later that he was leaking spinal fluids as a result of the injury. I'm no doctor, but that can't be good. Jason Statham. In addition to being a great actor, Jason also did his own stunts, which nearly cost him his life when filming The Expendables 3, where a truck he was driving malfunctioned and drove straight into the Black Sea. <laughs> Statham, being an experienced diver, swam to safety like it was no big deal. Ryan Reynolds. Oh, hello. I know, right? Whose balls did I have to fondle to get my very own movie? Being really excited about landing the Deadpool role, Ryan gave it his all while getting in shape in the gym that he threw out his back and literally had to crawl back home on all fours. It's a pity he didn't have Deadpool's regenerative powers. Jeremy Renner. It's amazing how Jeremy performs his stunts while playing the role of Hawkeye. However, on one such occasion, he hurt his back and shoulders so badly that the movie's production was halted for days. Channing Tatum. In the movie Foxcatcher, Channing Tatum got so deep into character that he smashed his face into a real mirror. Not once, but thrice, which caused very real lacerations on Tatum's face. Talk about devotion to character. Chris Evans. While shooting the helicopter scene where Captain America was holding it down from flying off, the helicopter moved the wrong way and hurt Chris's shoulder, an injury which still aches a bit till this day, according to the actor. <laughs> Seth Rogen. The interview was not without any drawbacks after its production, as Kim Jong-un declared that all publicity for the movie would be considered an act of terrorism thanks to it making a character out of him. <laughs> Excuse me. Did you just shark? <laughs> no, I didn't. It was a dead camera guy. It wasn't me. Ladies and gentlemen, Kim Jong-un has just pooed <laughs> in his pants.